about this again. All right, so these messages are general. They won't resonate with every single Aquarius, okay? So these messages are for specific people, okay? So um, if it does not resonate, check your moon and your rising videos, okay? You may have messages there that will resonate with you better, okay? So we're going to see what energy is coming towards Aquarius for the month of November. What's going on with Aquarius? for the month of November, all right? November, November, November. What's going on with Aquarius for the month of November? November. All right, Aquarius, at the bottom of the deck, I see you guys trying to decide on whether or not to walk away from um, a situation, okay? Maybe someone around you possibly wants to walk away or you could be vice versa. But I feel like someone finds the truth out. Some There's some truth that comes out, okay? Or someone is communicating. Someone finds out that someone is communicating with someone. Um, I feel like someone wants to, I'm even getting like someone wants to make someone feel stuck or trapped in a situation. Be careful because I feel like someone is trying to trap somebody or keep somebody feeling like they're stuck. Um, let's see. Let's see what's going on. This is interesting. Guys, this energy is the seven of cups. Okay, so maybe you are the one who needs to make the decision. You may feel like someone is trying to obligate you to something or trying to make you feel trapped in a situation, make you feel like you have no way out. Um, but I feel like you guys possibly have a lot more other options, a lot of other different avenues that you can go in. Okay, so you're looking, possibly looking at your options. Okay. Yeah, I feel like the challenge is you aren't sure which choice to make. You're not sure which direction to go. You're not sure how this is going to go. If I take this way, where is this going to lead? If I do this way, what is this going to bring? Okay, we got you guys' energy. Queen of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, okay? So the decision is up to you, okay? I feel like maybe you have been ignoring someone, okay? Or someone has been ignoring you and you feel like you need to make the decision, um, but I do feel like you feel like there's a decision that you need to make. You could be dealing with someone very toxic in your past, okay? The situation could be toxic. There could be some type of addiction, some type of codependency, um, some obsessive behavior. Maybe you feel like someone could possibly be obsessed with you, um, but there is like some toxic stuff going on here. You could be dealing with the Capricorn. This is the Capricorn card, okay? What's crowning you is the six of pentacles. So maybe you are giving someone an ultimatum um, or you feel like someone is giving you an ultimatum. But I feel like this is a give and take situation. Maybe you feel like um, the situation could be unrequited. It could be toxic. You may feel like this person isn't giving enough. Okay, so we have you in the future, guys, focusing on yourself. Okay, focused on your money, being independent, and possibly, you know, if you have to cut this toxic person off, I feel like you're willing to. Okay, we have the nine of pentacles. All right. So I feel like you guys are possibly just going to be making a decision um, to walk away from a situation. I feel like some type of truth comes out or um, something is said. And, you know, you feel like you have to make this decision. Okay, let's see. I'm curious. I want to know why the devil card is here for Aquarius. Why is the devil card here? Yeah, you've been arguing and fighting with this person. This person has been giving you a hard time. You could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. But someone here is like... They may show their affection and love by arguing with you, and it's extremely toxic. It could be a, um, an Aries, but this is the father card, okay? So this could be like 
a baby mom or a baby father situation and it's just like toxic it's just toxic okay it's just extremely toxic someone is being very controlling possessive possibly acting like they own you or vice versa okay but the situation is extremely toxic okay there's there's arguments and disagreements here okay and the situation is toxic why is the six of pentacles here Why is the Six of Pentacles here? All right, Page of Wands. Okay, so someone wants to communicate. Someone wants to tell you how they feel. Okay, this is the same person because the same energy can't back out. Okay, King of Cups and the Emperor. Someone needs to control their emotions. Okay. Um, maybe you feel like this person is giving, just giving you problems or giving you, you know, the cold shoulder or negative energy. And I feel like you just aren't here for it. Like you've been trying to block it out. You've been possibly trying to ignore this person because you possibly got other things going on, other options. And you're probably just looking at this person like, you know, I'd rather just be single. I'd rather just focus on myself. I'm busy right now. Why is the nine of pentacles here? Maybe they're telling you they're going to give you something or calling you. You want them to call you only when, you know, when they get something together or when they found some type of balance. It's kind of like, call me when, you, when you're when you talking, you know, with a little bit more sense. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? Yeah. So you're focused on money. You're focused on, you know, and it's the same person, okay? Look, it's the same person. A lot of you guys are dealing with them, someone who is very stubborn, someone who is possibly, like, controlling, kind of, like, arrogant type of energy. Um, but, you know, I feel like you are focused on your money, okay? You want to talk if it's beneficial. I don't want to talk to you if it's not beneficial, okay? Why is the Page of Wands here? Ace of Wands. Maybe you aren't wanting to be sexual with this person. Okay. You're shutting this person down and you are possibly like keeping your guard up. I definitely see you keep guys keeping your guard up here with the strength card. Could be a Leo. Okay. Maybe you're deciding, look, to end this, cut this person off for good and walk away. Okay. We got Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Okay. You could be dealing with the air sign like yourself, or this could just be you. Okay. You feel like you've tried and this is just not going to work. Why is the two of swords here? Yep, you are ignoring this person. You you don't want to communicate with this person. Maybe you've even blocked this person, okay? You possibly even blocked this person. Like, you know, I don't want to talk to you. I have other things going on. I got other options. Why is the Seven of Cups here? And the Sun card. You have better options. Okay, you you got better options, okay? And you feel like, you know, they're worried about me. I got other stuff going on. They need to focus on themselves cuz I'm focusing on me. This person is probably coming at you with drama, bringing you bringing you all this negative energy, okay? And you're just like, you know, I'm over it. 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 Let me dig a little deeper here. Let's see how they feel about Aquarius, okay? I feel like somebody, you guys feel like somebody trying to trap y'all. Trying to make you feel stuck. How do they feel about Aquarius? How do they feel about Aquarius? How do they feel about Aquarius? Woo! Okay, they, have, they are waiting for you. They're waiting for this conversation. They want to have a conversation with you, okay? They have possibly even been reaching out to your friends, talking to your friends, or talking to people that you know to try to get some help um, on how to deal with this situation. 
Give me another card. How do they feel about Aquarius? How do they feel about Aquarius? How do they feel about Aquarius? All right, we have engagement. They are wanting things to, they're wanting to level up with you, okay? They are wanting some type of commitment from you, okay? They're wanting some type of commitment from you. Um, the, here we go with this heart-to-heart -heart conversation again, okay? They're wanting some type of commitment from you, okay? They want a commitment. Give me one more card for Aquarius. Give me one more card. Oh, you guys could be dealing with like a psycho stalker type person. Well, give me one more card for Aquarius. What other message? How do they feel about Aquarius? So I'm feeling like you guys are having to block this person, ignore this person, and they keep coming at you. Trying to trap you, make you feel stuck. Trying to obligate you. All right, we got to free yourself, okay? It's time to take back control of your life. And then we got trust, okay? So there could be trust issues. You may not trust this person, okay? They may feel like you are playful, okay? Like you play around a lot. They may have trust issues with you, okay? So I feel like they feel as if you're taking back control of your life they're in the future they're going to be feeling like there's nothing that they can do because you've taken back control over the situation okay you you put a stop to it you put it into the mind games the the, the toxic energy you have completely um put a stop to it you've taken back control okay wow <laughs> well i don't know why they playing with y'all aquarius are you know don't play those type of games you know well that's their loss okay i don't blame you if the energy is bad they got to go okay so if these messages resonated guys make sure you leave me a thumbs up don't forget to comment share with your family and your friends and if you're new click that bell and the notifications so you can get all of the upcoming readings okay all right my loves ciao for now My aura bright like the moon and stars Moving fast like the shooting star I be my own lane, no movie star If this ain't no act, I can't play your part My aura bright like the moon and stars Moving fast like the shooting star I be my own lane, no movie star If this ain't no act, I can't play your part Dr. Fire bring higher I got the heat, I'm on fire the Empress of the Empire, Goddess of Desire.